Hi, I'm Josh Ellsworth and welcome to video number 17 of 21 in our Steal This Look heat printing series. The idea behind these videos is we show you top trending looks that we're expecting for 2021 and equip you on how to print them and sell them. More on that in a moment. We're in the corporate gifting market, which is a major opportunity for your business to generate sales. In the video prior to this, we decorated this high-end vest with an embroidered patch and showed you the technique on how to execute it properly on our Hotronics 360 IQ hat heat press. Now we're gonna show you the more traditional use for this Hotronics 360 IQ hat heat press by decorating, you guessed it, a hat. The reason I love headwear for this particular opportunity in corporate gifting is if you purchase a snapback, like we're gonna decorate here today, it's pretty much a one size fits all opportunity or one size fits most. So it makes it very easy on the client that's buying from you to plan and buy for their particular staff. If you have to manage shirt sizes, there's a lot more back and forth and work to go through. And so hats are a great opportunity. Now, we wanna decorate this hat, this snapback trucker, with one of our top trending products, and that is a genuine leather patch. So come on in close to the heat press, and I'll show you exactly how to execute this look. First things first, I'm gonna flip my sweatband out to try to get an even print area. This is the loading technique you wanna use, where you flip the sweatband out, and then you slide the hat onto the lower base, making sure the sweatband stays flipped out and the bill is aligned with the little ridge on our heated lower platen. Now I've said heated lower platen because we are going to warm this hat from underneath as well as the top. I've locked down the hold down device to get good contact and then I'm just going to maneuver the hat slightly to try to get no gap in between my printing zone. Now this is a structured cap, something that would typically leave a mark, but with this hat press, we don't need to worry about creases or markings. I also don't need to worry about applying directly over the seam because that's exactly what we're going to do. So I'll position my leather patch into place. I'm just gonna hold it there for a second. It's heating from underneath, that's warming the adhesive, and that's going to get it to hold just temporarily in place, enough that I can grab our special cover pad and place on top of the patch. Now all of these components are critical to the recipe with getting accuracy. The heated lower platen, the silicone molded base, the special cover pad, and then the recommended recipe. I'll lock the press down and I'm at 280 degrees on top, 320 degrees on the bottom heat for 30 seconds. Once the press counts down to zero, it'll automatically open. The press also has a pressure readout and I'm sitting on a four right now, which is a medium pressure. It runs on a scale from one to nine, and you can make your pressure adjustments right here to raise um, and lower the top heated platen. After the application has been complete, the press automatically opens, I remove my pad, and then I like to remove my hat from the press to present it. So we'll take our hat off, we'll flip the sweatband back in, and let's get an up close look. I just love the way a leather patch looks on any product. This is our caramel color in the leather patch, the genuine leather. We sell three styles and it just pops off of this black hat, creating a really high-end look that can be executed in 30 seconds time. So what do you think? I think this is a look your customers will love for corporate gifting. It's something you can sell to that market plus many others. And the best part is to complete something like this, you just need a couple feet of counter space. The 360 IQ is a really small footprint. It's really simple and easy to use, and you'll create perfect looking headwear every time. To download the photography of this look, click the link in the description and make sure you keep watching for one additional idea into the corporate gifting market. Thanks.